Ciao everybody, Caterina here. Welcome to my kitchen. Well, I have my beautiful mother coming for Mother's Day. And I thank God every time I'm able to say those words. And I'm preparing a few desserts for her because she loves my desserts. And one particular um, cookie that I'm going to be preparing today is amaretti cookies. Delicious, easy to prepare. Now let's get started. You're going to need your food processor for this particular cookie. Um, I have four cups of slivered almonds. To the almonds, I'm going to add two cups of granulated sugar. Now you do want to uh, pulse these together. This way you don't end up with almond butter. One teaspoon of baking powder. Okay, now we're going to blitz it till it looks like sand. Okay, that's it. Perfect. Now I'm just going to transfer it to a bowl and we're going to start with the egg whites. We're going to start with the wet mixture now. I'm going to separate four eggs at room temperature. I took out these eggs two hours ago. Okay, so we just want the egg white. Now I'm just going to give you this tip again. I put the um, eggshells, I keep them um, for the spring when we start with our garden and uh, I put them around the plants, uh, around my herbs and it keeps all the little insects away. To the egg whites, I'm going to add one teaspoon of pure almond extract. There. Okay, I'm going to add this to my mixer and I'm going to fluff up the egg whites. Okay. We're just going to keep this up until the egg whites become very stiff. Okay, it's ready. This is how you want it. A nice stiff peak. I'm just going to do this until it all falls down. There we are. Okay, now we're just going to take the egg whites and we're going to fold them into the dry mixture. That's all. Okay, so just mix it in a circular motion, a figure eight, until it becomes a lovely, lovely paste. This is bringing back so many memories. I remember we would only see these um, amaretti cookies when we would go to a party, a special occasion, a baptism, a wedding. And my mother would say to me in my ear, Katerina, go over to the, the greeting table where the cookies are and get the amarettis for me, get the amarettis. And I would go and I would, I would literally just take all the amarettis, put them in a napkin and bring them to my mother. Okay, so this is how you want it to look like a paste. Like this. Now we can start uh, scooping them out on the trays. Okay, so here I have um, a, a, a little more than a tablespoon scooper. I'm just going to grab it here and just scoop. Now you want to make them at least um, an inch and a half apart because they will spread. It gives me so much joy that I'm able to make these for my beautiful mother, really. It really does, because she doesn't have to fill her purse with eight or nine of them. I'm going to make her two, three dozen, and they're all for her, so she can really enjoy them. And more importantly, they baked with so much love for this beautiful woman. Okay, so my amaretti are ready. Um, I chose to make them large. You can make them half the size, but I like big amaretti cookies. And besides, my mama deserves big amaretti cookies. Now, what I'm going to do is I toasted some almonds at 350 for about seven, eight minutes. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take the almond and place it right in the center of the cookie. My mother used to always give me the almond. Just going to sprinkle. Um, icing sugar over each individual one. My amaretti are complete. Now we're just going to set them aside for two and a half hours to dry before we bake them. 
preheated my oven at 300 degrees Fahrenheit. And now I'm going to uh, put them in the oven uh, for approximately 20, 22 minutes. When they're golden brown, I know they're ready. I'm going to dredge them again with icing sugar and we're gonna let them cool thir uh, thoroughly for about half an hour. My amaretti cookies came out beautiful. Therefore, my beautiful mother on Mother's Day, she's going to love them. I'm going to taste one for you. I have my cappuccino. Mmm. Mmm. Crunchy on the outside. Chewy on the inside. Absolutely delicious. My beautiful mother is going to love them. And she has a full tray to feast on. I would like to share a picture that I'm, that it, actually this is my favorite family picture. And it's of my beautiful mother, the most beautiful woman in the world, and my sweet papa, with my siblings. I absolutely love this picture. And I have to say that I thank God that he gave me one of his angels for me to call mama because my mother is truly an angel from heaven that God put on this earth to become our mother. I absolutely love this woman and I'm so grateful for everything that she's done for us. I want to thank you all for joining me today and it's Katerina from my home to yours. Bye.